The mood in Radche Nursing College is festive, as volunteer students busily prepare for the photo exhibition and panel discussion on midwifery. This unique event brings together international, national, and local stakeholders to increase awareness and motivation of the students with respect to midwifery and related issues. In Bangladesh, 72% of childbirth are taking place at home. Urban population is increasing at an annual rate of 6%, where only one-third of all births are attended by the skilled professionals. Diploma in Midwifery course has recently been introduced in Bangladesh, where new health professionals will be developed. This type of event creates awareness among the population to access quality midwife services. It ensures availability of information among maternal and child health care, and stimulates discussion at various levels of the population regarding the right to quality care for mothers and their children, to minimize the gap between care providers, consumers, and stakeholders. Sayada Nazma Begum of Rajshay Nursing College gave her welcome speech. Emran ul Haq, team leader of ABDC, GIZ project in Rajshay, in his speech focusing on sustainable midwifery services education, expressed the need for social change and also mentioned some relevant data on maternal child health. Other distinguished guests also delivered their welcome address. Ms. Forida Begum discussed the implementation of the ICM standards-based program to achieve MDGs number four and five ahead of time. She said midwives can contribute to stop two-thirds of all maternal deaths in the country. In that area, we have advanced considerably. What we were supposed to achieve by 2015 under the MDGs, whether you say 500 or 1,000, we have surpassed that. As a result, what is called the HMPS will continue on. And already we have told the management, you will be teachers, you will be educated, we've told the policymakers. Ms. Shuraya Begum confidently stated that a bright future is waiting for midwifery graduates and highlighted capacity development of educational institutions, scope for higher education and career opportunities for midwives. Ms. Shuraya Begum describes the immense scope of opportunities for higher education and jobs for midwives in Bangladesh. She also restated the commitment of the highest level of the government of Bangladesh to ensure better education and employ huge numbers of skilled midwives in the country. Brigadier General AKM Nasiruddin expressed his satisfaction with the skilled midwives serving in his hospital. He encouraged medical professionals to work closely together for ensuring better maternal health outcomes. The students of Rajshay Nursing College distributed the crest of Mementus to the honorable guests. On the previous day, a quick quiz competition had been organized for midwifery students, and the winners were awarded with prizes. The photos displayed in the exhibition were on family lifestyle, different aspects of maternal child health care like preconception, prenatal, labor, birth, postnatal, neonatal care.
Most of the selected photographs showcased in the exhibition have been taken by the renowned Nepal-based American photographer Thomas Kelly, who came to Bangladesh in early 2014, and by Mr. Jewel, who was selected from Ranchai as a photographer. I am really enjoying the program. Actually, this is the first time that this type of event has taken place in Rajshay for midwifery. I see that there's a lot of new things that are happening. The education standards are also improving. I really enjoyed it. Midwifery students arranged a brief theatrical performance illustrating the dangers of preeclampsia, which created a lot of attention among the audience. 